Tap the probe icon to check the status of the battery. Before the first use, setting some user-defined preferences will make the app's operation more convenient. Tap Auto Freeze and set the desired time for the transducer to automatically enter freeze mode when not actively in use. This helps to preserve the battery. Tap Short Press and set the function of the K1 key for a quick press. Tap Long Press and set the function for a long press. Tap the System Tools button in the upper left corner of the screen. Tap Setup Image. Display TIB, TIC, and TIS according to user preference. Set the length of the time for the Cine clip. These user-defined settings can be changed whenever needed. There are several ways to input patient information. One. Acquire patient information by using a DICOM work list. Tap the System Tools button in the upper left corner of the screen. Tap Patient and Review. Tap Work List to download patient information from the server. Join the network and test the setting of the server. Select the patient from the querying list. 2. Manually input patient information with the keyboard. 3. Acquire patient information by scanning a barcode. To do this, in the Patient Info screen, tap the Scan icon to enter the scanning interface. After inputting patient info, Swipe the screen from left edge to right. Scroll and tap to select an exam mode. 